this tent, as you can see, is a great tent. Um, it was donated to the Falklands and the, the Falklands Defence Force by uh, a company, in the, or two companies in the US, UTS Systems and uh, Dynovis Shelters. Uh, and that was really instigated by uh, Andy Tubb, who's a 1982 veteran who was here with 4-5 Commando. And he works for the company and, and was aware it was the 40th anniversary. Uh, so he approached FIG um, about making this donation. And then with a lot of work and uh, some support from FIGO, we've um, managed to get him here this week. Uh, he's training the guys on the tent and also um, it's something we can use for the community. So we're actually going to take it out and use it at landing day on Saturday as a shelter. Uh, we often take a tent out there and it's a good chance to sort of showcase this and also let you know, people from the Falklands use it. So it, it's a really great um, donation, very generous. It is in the shape and form of an a, uh, exoskeleton tent, uh, which the US military use, uh, generally form for command or field hospitals or field, field accommodation. Uh, all integral, can be taken apart and field repaired, so it's, it's quite state of the art. can be put up in 15 minutes with, with uh, very simple, simple training, so hopefully it's going to serve well and uh, last many years. It's a really great um, donation, very generous. Uh, and we've really got to say thank you to Andy and, and the company he works for, for their generosity, really. Well, obviously, obviously my connection with the island for the campaign, um, back in 82, we wanted to give it to something that, uh, one, served the connection with the Royal Marines from my background, and secondly, to support the community, because the FID will support the community as custodians of the shelter, and it gives access to other, the other services, emergency services and charity organisations here and to support further veterans maybe coming down for ceremonies on the island in future years. It's, it's great that we can put shelter up, you know, whether that's a search and rescue exercise or an actual call out, uh, or if we're doing a training camp, sometimes when you're training people you want to give them a bit of cover from the wind. You know, I know we make people sleep outside, but uh, this sort of tent gives us the opportunity to put some shelter up, get people out the wind, uh, and also, as I say, um, other events where you know, people might, might want some shelter, which is quite often needed here in the Falklands. So it's, it's a multi-role, multi-use um, asset that we've got now. It's great to be back. It's a bit sort of, I don't know, I don't know how to, how to phrase it really, but it's sort of weird and scary and all wrapped up into, into one, you know, coming back. But it's good to be back. The, the guys at the Falkland Defence Force have been very accommodating and then help me out and we've, we've got the shelter here so hopefully everything goes plain sailing from now.